Hey everyone, it's Pikmin Dude for all six here. And today we're playing Pikmin again. So a few things before we start. So I actually recorded the first five vi first five videos. I decided I decided to publish the first. But the rest they were in reverse. Like the screen was flipped horizontally. I should know vertically, I think. Not horizontally. So the screen was flipped horizontally. So I decided to like redo my setup. Which is Yeah, it's pretty terrible. But uh, it still works. You can see most, if not all, the screen. And yeah, so, so here's, okay, so a tip for, um, if you want to return to an earlier day, you can press minus or plus to return to the earlier day. So, if I start at day one, that's going to be the very first episode all over again, so I have to start at day two. And yeah, if you press yes, you will not be able to recover. So yeah, be very cautious. So as you can see, there are a few stars at the bottom of the area. There's the title in the top left, a little bit of information on the bottom left. There's a ship log which is like the everyday thing and then if you press minus you can return to cartel's name in the top right you see your the number of days and in the middle right you'll see a picture of the of the area and how many parts it has the flashing parts or flashing stars are the parts that you have collected, but the more dull ones, they're the ones you haven't. So let's get started. <coughs> forest of Nope. That's what I call this. This is the Forest of Nope. Because there's a lot of Nopes in it. First of all, you want to nope this cutscene. And then, you want to nope two Pikmin. And then you want to kill them all. Nope. You just put them on this thing. See if they can break it. I wonder if they can break it. Anyway, I'm going to get the other two Pikmin. And then throw one Pikmin on this. Throw the other on. Actually, not on there. That's a different color, by the way. That's yellow, in case you're colorblind or something. I know what it. I'm pretty sure my dad is. And he could watch. Could be watching. Oh, come on! Only stupid one got flowered. So, Nectar! They flower your Pikmin. So when a, when a Pikmin is flowered, it reduces the chance of, of tripping over, I think. I think that might be in Pikmin 3, but it reduces their chance of tripping over, makes them faster, and that's pretty much it. They could go back and forth between these stages depending on like the type or like how you use them. I think it's switch between these by pressing down on the D pad. Or I'm using the the Wii version, Wii Motion Plus. So yeah, it's down on the D pad for me. These are dwarf bulwarks. Um, they're basically baby versions of 
that guy, but they're not actually related. So yeah. Um, they're very easy to kill with if you have like a relatively large or just like a medium sized group. So here, first part. I'm not gonna get it yet. Oh look, a blue pellet. I don't want to actually yeah, you can carry that. Let's see if we carry this. And yeah. So I'm gonna get my all my picking flowers in a second. As you can see, there's a day meter up there. That that shows how much day you've got left, how much of the day. When it hits the end, um, or in, in this area where my pointer is pointing, um, it'll say hurry up, your day's almost over. It's pretty useful because like there's a if there's a Pikmin on the other side of the map, you could get it before the day's over. So yeah. There's a, okay, so more to the topic of the stage of the Pikmin. There are three stages, leaf, bud, and flower. You only see the leaf and flower. Fla uh, nectar instantly makes the Pikmin a flower Pikmin, unless they're already a flower. Because then they just ignore it. And also in this game, one Pikmin can drink one blob of nectar. But then you could just, and then get most of majority of your Pikmin. Also, I did that by pressing down the D-pad. If you want to switch to like the stage, you just hold A and press down. But yeah. So I'm gonna do something that I'm sure a lot of you know about, or at least all a lot of you Pikmin fans. <laughs> There, I just, I just like bomb rush that bulldog. Oh, you can see that there's also a bud Pikmin here. I'll throw a few. <coughs> so bud Pikmin, they basically like, uh, they're in between leaf and flower Pikmin. There are two ways you can get bulb, bulb, uh, bud Pikmin. Uh, one you can they their state when they're like born you know how pikmin are born and they like just form sprouts on the ground when you leave the sprout long in the ground for enough it'll eventually mature into a bud pikmin and then a flower pikmin <coughs> you can get the bud pikmin but you can also get the flower pikmin if you wait long enough or if you're impatient, you could just pluck the leaf Pikmin. There are a few instances where um, you wait so too long, and and when it's a flower, it will eventually go back into the leaf Pikmin. At least that's what I think it is. Um, I heard a few YouTubers say that, like, or a few Pikmin players say that that's not the case. It's like they die, I think. But I'm pretty sure they just go back to leaf Pikmin. So that enemy is a um, uh, Bulborb. It's not adult Bulborb, it's just Bulborb. You could say it's an adult Bulborb, but it's, but that those those smaller ones, that that one, they're not actually they're babies. They're actually not from the same family. You could check this out in Pikmin 2 in the thing so so hilariously called the Piclopedia. That game is taking a long time. And also, if you play Pikmin 2, this map may seem very familiar. This is actually Awakening Wood. See here, you would get the berries. Um, I, I don't know what it's called, but something like 
berry spider wart or something. <coughs> so in this game you can mash A while you're plucking Pikmin. Or one will automatically go to the next Pikmin. <coughs> Did they finish the bridge? I think they might. Did they? They did it. Okay. So 62 Pikmin. Ooh, ooh. Um, here it might not happen, but if a small bulb or a dwarf bulb or um, is it being attacked by Pikmin? Oh, it may cry and awaken the mommy bobo. You do not want that to happen. Otherwise, your Pikmin will die for sure. Unless you have like a billion of them. Now, I'm not sure if I talked about this in the first video, but I'm going to just quickly review it. This is how many Pikmin are in your squad. This is how many Pikmin are in the field. This is how many Pikmin are in, exi in existence. So, new onion. It's yellow. I remember in the first video I made a joke about it being, being brown. I, I, I did actually do it in the failed recording of this video. What? Oh. Go sit in this corner. Good Pikmin. And new Pikmin type. That rock is really in the way. Okay. So yellow Pikmin. They have ears instead of noses. I. Okay. So they're basically the same. Except. And la later, you'll fi figure out that red Pikmin are actually immune to something. Yellow Pikmin aren't immune to that. <sighs> they are immune to something else, but that isn't in this game. They just merely carry these things called... Um, actually, they could be thrown higher. Here, let me grab a, no a yellow Pikmin in there. Wait, uh-oh. Okay. So I'm gonna throw a yellow Pikmin and then I'm gonna throw a red Pikmin. Did you see that the yellow Pikmin was thrown higher? <coughs> That's their strength, at least one of them. The yellow Pikmin actually have like, in the third game, they actually have the most amount of strengths. So, they're kind of like the best, I guess, in the third game, but no, that's not entirely true. There's no best type of Pikmin. Those other other YouTubers like to say, oh, this Pikmin is the best because it could do this. And this Pikmin is the best because it could do that. No, this Pikmin is the best because it's the cutest or something. Yeah, I really don't have a favorite Pikmin. I just like them all. <laughs> so I'm actually What? That landed perfectly on the screen. Oh whatever. So another thing I might not have mentioned. So Pikmin could carry two types of things back to the back to the onion. They can, they can carry back pellet posies, red pellets, or they can carry um, enemy corpses. So basically like anything that can be defeated is like, yeah. So I'm just raising my yellow numbers here. I'm gonna get some of the stuff over there because that's gonna take long. My day's almost over. I'm not gonna get that. I'm gonna get these things. 
Okay, so you might, you probably have noticed. The old Pikmin are slow. I'm just gonna play, put, actually no, leaf Pikmin are slow. Not, it's not yellow Pikmin, because you could, like, flower yellow Pikmin. Eight, eight, eight. Only one Pikmin on the thing. And two Pikmin on you. One Pikmin on you. Two Pikmin on you. Set two Pikmin on you. One Pikmin on you. One Pikmin on you. One Pikmin on you. They'll, they'll sort it out. No, they won't. Nope. Okay, so sorry for this moment of silence. So, yeah. Did I get that bull board? Yeah. Should I? Wait, did I have three people? Oh, I can't check because I don't have a certain part yet. to work on that and you to work on that. And then we we'll get the rest of these open. And when the sundown starts going off, uh where's the count starts going off. Pikmin in the field, that's not <coughs> Uh oh, that's not good. Never mind. <sighs> Is there really that many Pikmin in the field? I uh, wish it was like Pikmin 3 so you could like pluck three sprouts at once. I'm not gonna pluck them all right in. <coughs> Okay, so, end of the day. Yeah, there's no way. Anyway, so that's the end of today. Yeah. So, if you think there should be a map in this game, then there is, but you need um, a certain part for it. So, I can save. This is gonna be the end of the video. Remember to like, subscribe, share. <coughs> Wait. Remember to like, subscribe, share, comment, and hit that notification bell. That's it for today. See you later, pickies. Goodbye. Blah blah blah. Yeah. Bonus if you stay. Um, you can actually spam between um, the two areas. If you keep on doing this, the, the ship will freak out. It works better if you have like more than two areas. But you can eventually get the, the Omar ship off screen. And if this ship can do this, then why can't he go back to like his own planet? Anyway, so this is true end of the video. Goodbye.